Morning guys, welcome back to the One Auto channel. Got this one here behind me, 2011 Fiat 500. It's got a broken door handle. So what happens with these things is the front hinge of the door handle breaks. So uh, as you can see, it's busted. So uh, I've already done the other side actually. Uh, I did record it but accidentally deleted the footage which really annoyed me. Um, the only difference is this side hasn't got your lock bell. So I've got a new one from the Fiat dealer. There's the part number if anyone wants it. Where is it? Just there. So what do we get for our money? Sort of shiny-ish sort of door handle. Right, let's get it on. Okay. This door panel's got to come off. So, we do that, get yourself a small screwdriver. The plastic trim tools are a bit too thick to get under there. Yeah, just get a small screwdriver. Just gently lever that out, like that. And in there you've got two 5mm uh, Allen hex key things that have got to come undone. And then you've got to take off this trim here, around the ha inner handle. So get to a point where we can get underneath it like that that's even better and then work your way around and that comes off with that sort of setup at the back there and that reveals another five mil in there this those out that's the one I remember when I did the other side, it was a right fiddle to get the, the door, new door handle in. We'll see how this one goes. Right, now we've got to get a bigger trim tool. Get underneath the, the panel. You might find you have to put your leg underneath to hold the outer door. Sort of pull it and lever it at the same time, they're very stiff. Work your way around. That's it. Then there's going to be an inner cable for this piece. It needs to come off. Right. So we've got to press this little tab down, pull that out, and then slide that over and lift, lift it out. So now get yourself a sharp blade, just cut the inner membrane just around about here. That's going to expose the little 10 mil nut that we need to undo. So there's the nut there, and then we've got to release, release the uh, rod from the handle on the lock mechanism just down there. So there we go, that's released. Get this nut undone now. Then on the inner edge of the door here, you've got a 30 Torx. We'll crack that undone, take it out. Just going to pull the handle out a little bit and get rid of this broken piece before we take the handle out. And that's the bit I've just removed. As you can see, it snapped just there. You see. Okay, so getting these handles out is a nightmare, basically. I've just taken off the broken hinge, the stud that was sticking through there, so we're not going to, that's just soft on this side, so we're not going to damage the paintwork. Um, let's have a look. I think you've got to sort of go up that way, press the sprung loaded bit 
that bit down and fiddle it out. So we'll just see where we go. That way. Go. Let's pop the bottom piece out. Like I say, am I bleeding pain? Let's see if I can lever the rod out. out the way now. There we are. Nightmare job. Right, so just wash this area. Um, get some masking tape and just mask off an area around um, because it is such, so dodgy getting it back on. There's every possibility we could scratch the paintwork, and I really don't want to do that. Because you've got these little castellated cutouts just down here, and they've got a line up with the, uh, these castellated bits here, you see. So um, I'm going to put the rod that I popped off that was in the bottom of the door, I've just retrieved that somewhere. That's going to go back in there like that. But I'm going to do that once it's in. Once that clicks in, that clicks in quite tight. I'm going to do that once it's inside the door. I'll give that a go now then. Okay, here's the new handle. That piece is where the screw with the T30 goes in the end. That's sort of got to go in first. <sighs> Jiggling and pulling and poking and get these castellated bits lined up. There's the hinge that broke. There is only a Phillips screw, I believe Alfa Romeo for one of their vehicles sell the same hinge but I can't get hold of that right now so we've had to go for the whole lot. So, so we go in at the back first of all, press this piece down. such a tight fit, it just wanted a little bit more extra room. It's not in at the bottom. About there, so let's take the tape off. Slide it backwards. Sound good. Yep, that's good. position where it was. And tighten it down. Now I'm gonna all I'm gonna do now is put that rod back on into that hole there and connect it into that black connector down there. Alright so we just check it before we put it back together. So that's that's latched. 
locked, open the handle, unlocked, lock it, just check the inner one still works, that still works. Great, put this membrane back on, put some tape around it, door car back on. solid handle. Cool. There we go guys, that's how you do the near side, passenger side door handle on your uh, Fiat 500. Uh, it's a lot simpler actually than the other side where the other side you've got a lock barrel in the back there where you pull a pin out, you've got to exchange the locks and there's another rod if I remember rightly as well. Uh, hopefully the video was of use to somebody, if it was please give us a thumbs up. Uh, if you haven't done those already please subscribe to the channel. And don't forget, connect to me on Facebook, Twitter, Google+. Thanks for watching.